What's up, you guys? My name is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you're enjoying my content, you can smash this up button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs. Couch to Sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash up, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate. If you choose to donate, I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. Um, I do. Okay, so I was um, I was in bed, sleeping like a baby. Um, I got up to use the restroom. Uh, I know that might be TMI, but it's the truth. Um, came in here, loved on my kitties, and then I received a channeling. I'm going back to bed. And it's a, it's a good one from what I understand so far. I guess we'll see. Um, but we'll, we'll see, see, I love you guys, um, so much, thanks for all the new subscribers, by the way, thanks so much, love and appreciate it, um, and also, I have another channel for the new subscribers, um, I have another channel, hashtag Leo Gang, it's hashtag, and it's all one thing, hashtag capital L-E-O-G-A-N-G, -G, exclamation point, if anybody wants to check that channel out, has about seven or eight readings on there. Um, I just recently revamped it and started it up about a month or so ago. Um, if you might want to check that out. Love you guys. Okay. So, um, the channel message I received was, um, these are psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages, by the way, so one may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else. You plug it in how it resonates. Okay, so the channel message I received was um, someone is about to check out someone's psychic um, psychic channel soon, I heard, um, on YouTube. I heard on YouTube. I heard um, they're actually um, going to be impressed. They're going to be impressed and many series of chain events are going to occur. I heard they're going to learn about this psychic channel um, in a way they would have never expected. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Psychic channels unite. Y'all know I'm a psychic channel uh, that uses tarot cards and tarot readings, but um, there's many of us psychic investigators, social justice warriors, and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, out there on YouTube. And that's just the truth. So whoever this is for, um, you know, I get these channelings in. Sometimes they're for me. Sometimes they're not. Sometimes they're for others. So, I mean, my goodness, we have... Um, I draw in the energy of you guys receiving the spiritual downloads. I receive them for me sometimes and for you guys. Let's see. We're at like, what are we at? 13,000, almost 14,000 uh, subscribers right now. 13,920 subscribers right now. So, you know, it might be from, um, it might be me they check out. It might be another psychic is what I'm trying to say. I don't know because the spiritual downloads I draw in from the spiritual universe, it could be for any of us. And that's just the truth. I mean, I've got 13,920 of you guys on here. So you have to plug it in how it resonates. And then like 220 something something subscribers on my hashtag Leo game. So who knows? But whoever this is, they haven't done it yet, but they're about to. Um, apparently check out someone's, um, psychic channel on YouTube. So it is a psychic channel on YouTube. They could do tarot readings like me. Uh, like, you know, I'm a psychic investigator and I do my readings through tarot card readings. Um, sometimes I use cards, sometimes I don't or not. Um, I know you guys, a lot of my psychic investigators on that subscribe on my channel, you guys do them in different ways. So whoever this is, psychic person whether you're a psychic investigator or not someone is about to check your channel out soon it is on a channel on youtube i heard and they haven't done it yet they're about to i heard they're going to be impressed and many positive series of chain events are going to occur after they check out check out your channel whoever you are i heard they're about to learn about your channel in a very unexpected way so they were not expecting to learn about your channel. So I'm feeling somebody might share one of your 
uh, some of your work, like, I heard you do it on YouTube, so I'm assuming you have a channel, you have a video. I'm assuming they might share one of your videos. Maybe this person just runs across it, checks it out, or somebody talks about your channel, or they, or somebody talks about your channel on social media, they see your channel name, they search it on YouTube, they check it out that way. I mean, there's a plethora, or somebody talks about your channel out in the 3D with their gabber, like out in the world, and so they search your channel, and then they learn about it that way. However, that resonates and applies, okay? But somehow, they're about to learn about your channel soon, upcoming in the universe, it sounds like, so distant horizons soon, and they're, I heard they're going to be impressed, so I mean... That's that's awesome. Um, they're gonna like your work, whoever this is, uh, whoever this is for. Heard many positive series of chain events are going to occur. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Sorry, my hair. I mean, my gosh, it's four fifty three in the morning. I've got bed head. It's bad. So um, you plug it in, how it resonates. Okay. All right. I feel guided to get the tipper. Occupation number 34 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 34, it could be any um, any significant number in one's life. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to. Or any other significant number in one's life, number 34. In this um, aspect, uh, occupation definitely is a psychic, the online psychic on YouTube. Um, or we'll see if we hear anything else. But definitely I'm feeling you, online psychic, they're about to check out. That's your occupation, psychic. Um, let's see if we hear anything else. It's a masculine energy about to check out your channel. Well, seeing if you're telling the truth and they're about to realize you are. Okay, I heard it's a masculine energy about to check out your channel. Um, you're a feminine energy. You're a fem energy. So you're a fem energy psychic online YouTube psychic person, whoever you are. Um, there's a lot of us on here. I know there are a lot of psychic investigators subscribed to my channel. So I know you, I, what's up? I know, you, I know who you guys are. I know my peeps, just saying, just saying. It could be any of us, any of us. There's a lot of them psychic investigators. I know because a lot of you guys subscribe to my channel. <laughs> but um, I heard it's a masculine energy about to check out your channel. And obviously he did not know about it. Um, I'm presuming in the past, um, I'm presuming. But he's about to check it out. I heard he's about to be impressed. And you're a femme energy. Psychic. Femme, psychic, and masculine energy about to check out your channel. Just saying, just saying. Heard he's going to realize you're telling the truth. Um, so maybe he thought you were lying. Or he had reason to suspect you were lying. Or he was just verifying fact or facts however that resonates and applies okay oh they they were reversed hold on let's try again spirit messages you okay change and courtship main male holy shit a moly man what so when are you guys gonna get in a relationship oh my god hold on a second Nine, four, and one could be very significant numbers in one's life. Nine, four, one. We have change, upright, courtship, upright, main male, upright. That, that's how they fill out. Change, upright, courtship, upright, main male, upright. I wasn't intending on doing this reading at 4.56 a.m. on 8-11-2022, but we are here. All right, change. I heard it was a masculine energy. There's your masculine, femme, psychic, just saying, just saying.
Once he checks his channel out, it's about to give him a huge ass wake up call. Huge on many levels. He's about to take quick action to you soon. Wow. Holy shit, man. Um, holy shit, balls. <laughs> just saying, just saying. <laughs> I heard uh, once he checks your channel out, um, he's going to get huge ass wake up call in many ways, I heard. And he's going to take quick action towards you. So he doesn't know of your channel yet, or he's never been on your channel. Uh, psychic on YouTube. Them psychics on YouTube. He is new to your channel, ma'am. I'll tell you that. And that could be one of the changes, too. I know it's all crazy, but that's what we're dealing with here this morning. Um, that's one of the changes. He's new to your channel. He's checking out your channel. He's getting a wake-up call. And then uh, some other kind of um, changes. I heard it's going to take quick action towards you. So, I'm feeling that could be communication. I think it's communication. I think it's a phone call or an email or a snail mail or a face-to-face -face or a text or something. Um, what it, however that resonates, okay? Change energy. 555 five, five, change energy. This is the um, him checking out your channel, realizing you're telling the truth, impressed with you, taking action towards you. It is a new person, fem energy that has a channel, you have a channel on YouTube. He has never checked out your channel before on YouTube. But he's about to learn about it in some shape, form, or fashion. He's going to take action towards you. And I will say under the main mail upright, we have message. That could be the message. Just saying, just saying. Okay. Courtship. He's going to find you very attractive, but you don't play those kind of games. And he's going to realize that very quickly when he meets you in person. If y'all, if you guys decide to meet in person, it probably will happen soon. Okay, wow, Fem Energy. Okay, my God, this is moving fast. Holy shit. So I heard um, he will find you very attractive when he checks out your online channel. Um, he's going to find you very attractive. He, one, never even knew about your channel previously, but he's about to check it out soon. But once he checks out your channel, obviously your face is on there, I'm assuming, or your face and your body. He can see who you are, basically. He can see your face or your body or your body and your face. He can see you. It's Because, you know, some of us readers keep it, some of y'all keep it like this. The whole freaking time. I can't do that. Because I have to talk to somebody. And that's just the damn truth. I've been telling y'all that for two and a half years. I know some of you guys keep it down the whole time. You keep it on the cards the whole time. You keep it on your setting and your um your setup the whole time. I can't do that. Because I like to use my hands to explain and to interact. And I gotta have my screen, my hand, my face on the screen. And that's just the truth. Um, but some of you guys don't like that, and that's your personal preference and your free will, but I got to do it. So whoever you are, Fib Energy, you put your face on the screen too, is what I'm saying. Hurry's going to find you attractive, so you obviously, you're easy on the eyes. Um, and I heard um, you guys might meet soon. You might meet soon. So I think like face to face, um, I heard if you guys agree to meet, so I heard it probably will happen. So, that could be the change, too. There's a reason you guys might meet soon. Now, whatever reason that is, you might meet soon. Um, it probably will happen and happen soon. It probably will happen and happen soon. That's double deuces confirmation. It probably will happen and happen soon, you guys meeting. But there's some kind of reason you will meet soon. That could be professional, business, personal, or one or two or two plus of those. Um, but I think we have the courtship here because um, that's him finding you attractive. I don't think you guys are going to start dating, you know, because the change with the courtship could be like getting in a relationship. According to the channelings, I don't think it's that. I think it's he's just going to find you attractive and he might want to date you. He might want to date you. Um, but... You guys haven't even met yet, so I don't think it's going to come to that. Now, it might come to that down the line, but right now in the energetic space, you guys haven't even met. So, 
even though we pull in the courtship with the change, I think this is his, his attraction towards you, Femme Energy. And I'm just being for real. Because, um, and I'm just being serious. But you plug it in, how it resonates. Let me see if I hear anything else. For one of these masculine energies, he will probably break up with his partner soon. He's going to be very, very, very interested in you. But he knows you don't play no games and you're right. Okay. Okay. So, okay. So there's at least two masculine energies. But they're about to learn about your social media online psychic business, ma'am. One, um, they're both about to check your, out your uh, channel. Um, one of them is in a relationship right now. So they're dating or a committed relationship or even a marriage. Or maybe they're um, engaged. You plug it in how it resonates. Only they know their courtship situation, not anybody else. That's for one. One, I feel a single is a Pringle. One, I feel a single is a Pringle. But one, I feel is in a relationship. But I heard they... Um, they will probably end up breaking it off with their significant other soon. Now, that could be another masculine energy or a femme energy. Only they know what their preferences are. Probably a femme, though, because they find you attractive. Um, but I heard um, they'll probably end up breaking it off with their significant other soon. And they'll be very interested in you. So, I think you haven't met this person yet. They don't. This is a new to you person, ma'am. You have no clue who this person is. They're about to find out about you through your business, your work online, i.e. your probably your videos on YouTube. At least two masculine energies in the universe. And that's just the truth. One, I feel single. One is dating somebody. One that's dating somebody, they're, they're probably going to... I think them, the masculine energy about to break up with their partner soon has nothing to do with you. It's just that I think you might be an option to them. Nobody should be anybody's option. Or maybe you're either an option to them, like, or they are breaking up with this person to hopefully have a chance with you. That's what I'm feeling. Um, but hopefully you'll be able to discern that through um, nonverbal communication, Not uh, like if you end up meeting them in the 3D. Um You'll be able to discern it through like nonverbal cues or verbal communication with them, or maybe they just straight up tell you how they feel about you. If you end up meeting them, heard for one, you definitely probably will soon. Um, so you plug it in, how it resonates. So change uh, with the one that's in a relationship soon. It's, I, I'm assuming after you meet them, um, or maybe before, they're going to break up with their partner. One, I feel single as a Pringle, and they just want to be in a relationship with you. Um, after they um, check out your channel, uh, ma'am, because uh, they're going to find you very attractive. Main male. This is giving another masculine energy a huge ass wake up call, and it should. But this masculine energy had many years to pursue you. He has no chance now, none at all, and he knows this. Oh my God, this is getting so juicy. Ah! <laughs> I heard this is giving another masculine energy a huge ass wake up call. I heard he um had many years to pursue you, but basically he chose not to pursue you. <laughs> well, it's his loss. And that's just damn true. Um, he had many years to pursue you, and he basically chose not to. Um, <laughs> that's his karma. Karma. Um, and um, but it's his loss because he basically had many years to pursue you, basically. He basically missed an opportunity with you because I think he treated you like an option. Um, and so you moved on and he let, you know, he did whatever he did. I think this might be somebody in your community is what I'm feeling. Definitely somebody in your community. For one, for one, it's someone that was in your community and moved away. Okay, so at least two, ma'am. So these are the ones that basically treated, treated you like an option in the past, not the new one. 
because we have the new ones coming up, at least two new ones coming up, and at least two new ones, uh, or at least two old ones that passed that treat you like an option. One of them still lives in your community, so your town, province, city, etc., 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 and one used to live in your town, area, province, etc., 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 and has moved away. So you plug it in how it resonates. But these are people of your past that basically, when you see, they see you move on, somehow you're going to meet one of these people soon. Through series of time events is what I'm feeling. Somehow you're going to meet one of these people soon. Over here in this category. And you might possibly get it, end up in a relationship with them down the line. Possibly. Now it all depends on the actions you take and he takes and if y'all decide to do that. But possibility, I mean, according to channel messages, it's highly probable. Oh, hold on. Message. It would not be smart to pursue the masculine energies of the past. They are about to run into some serious problems. Legal problems. Police problems. Because of theft and an illegal business of the past. Oh, Lord. Okay, I heard it would not be smart to pursue the masculine energies of your past. You have at least four masculine energies in here, ma'am. I mean, I think these people already know about your channel, online channel, online psychic fem. These two don't. At least these two These two don't. They're about to learn of it. But these, I feel, do. They already, they already knew about your life. They already, or at least hopefully not in a stalker way, but they already knew about you, and they treat you as an option and move the hell on. So I think they already knew about your work or knew what you were up to. One lives in your damn community, so probably. One used to and moved away, so probably. These are people of your past, though. But um, I heard it would not be smart to interact with these people, though. The people of your past. Not the new ones, the people of your past. Because they're about to start getting into very heavy legal issues soon. And I heard police, police and legal issues. Because of an illegal business of the past and theft. So I think they stole from you. Or stole either from you or somebody you care about. You care about and some kind of illegal business. They might have been had ran an illegal business off of you. That might be why they didn't pursue you. Because they were making so much money off of you. Someone's getting a huge wake up call. Someone's getting a huge wake up call. I mean I'm just being pro. But I heard it would not be smart to pursue these people. The people of your past. It sounds like it's a green light with these people if you choose to pursue these people or they choose to pursue you. They are about to check your channel out soon. So, you know, you plug it in how it resonates. Message. There's about to be a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of communication here. A lot. And one of these new masculine energies about to check your channel out, they will contact the police about an illegal business of the past. It's about to go negatively for the masculine energies of your past. Okay. And there's about to be a lot, a lot, a lot of communication here. A lot. And um, one of these new masculine energies, I heard he's about to check you, uh, your channel out, ma'am. That's how he's about to learn about your channel and your work and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But one of these new ones, I heard he's going to call the police regarding an illegal business of the past. Somehow an illegal business of the past, you were tied into this, ma'am. Um, for some, I feel these were making, these people in your past were making money off of you through an illegal business. Possibly voyeur camera energy in the past. Possibly. I didn't hear that, but maybe. If not, they could have stole your pictures or sexy photos or something and, or did, um, or did some kind of sex video behind the scenes with an illegal voyeur camera or something. You know how people can be cray cray. So, however that resonates, but. I didn't hear specifically what it was, but it's some kind of illegal business of the past. I was just giving you examples of what I thought it could be. But one of these people is going to call the police. I think it's about to go badly for one of these folks. They have harmed you or wronged you or done something to you in the past. Theft and an illegal business of the past, I heard. But, it, but you, I think they stole from you and created an illegal business around you. Or you and your family, possibly, if you have their kids. Okay? But communication coming strong. I think communication about to come. These masculine energies, 
One of them, I think, is about to communicate with you because I feel for at least one of you guys, you're about to meet one of these soon. For some reason, it could be personal, professional, business, or two or two plus. These are new ones. I think, and one of these new people, masculine energies, knows one of these masculine energies of the past. So I think they might communicate to people of the past, possibly, or the communication could be to the police. So I feel the communication is going to come to you, ma'am, from the, at least one of the new ones. Communication to the police for one of, from one of the new ones about the illegal business of the past. I think they know some of the people of the past. And maybe some of these people, the new ones, are going to communicate to the old ones. Maybe. Only they know how they're about to communicate. But a lot of communication, a lot of messaging. I feel the message uh, energy is the communication. That could be text, email, phone call, face-to-face, -face, group chats, the police I heard in here. Whatever kind of communication you guys are about to send back and forth or they're about to send to the police, or what have you, what have you, okay? Let me see if I hear anything else. All right, I didn't, I didn't, but a lot of change is coming, a lot of change is coming. All right, well, I hope this helped, and I love you guys so much. If you think anyone else would like the channel, please feel free to share it very publicly on social media and word of mouth. Very much appreciate it. Single mom with two kids. Even though I don't have full custody um, of them right now, I still have visitation rights, and I plan on utilizing every single opportunity. Um, it's been hard, uh, but I'm going to get through it, just like I've gotten through a lot of hard things in my life. I love my kids with everything in me. I might not have full rights of them right now, but I still have visitation rights, and I'm going to use them. All right, I love you guys so much. Everybody have a wonderful day, and I'm going to stay.